Bobby Wine Oil. Oil. NUP Oil. Oil. IMF Z. Z. If you give money to a thief, it means you are also a thief. If you give money to a killer, you're also a killer. But let's be frank. The IMF's mission is not really to develop any African country. The IMF has been lending money to African countries for 60 years. Show me one developed country in Africa as a result of IMF money. So now we've exposed the true mission of the IMF, which is to maintain neocolonial puppets in African countries. The people that can manipulate Yes. People that do not owe their allegiance in power Correct. to the domestic population, yes. but owe their allegiance to yes. the yes. IMF. Correct. That is why we said that is there. Correct. How can you account for it? Somebody has been killing for 36 years, yes. stealing for 36 years, yes. and you still give him money? Yes. What does that mean? The people who work at the IMF are people with PhD degrees. Yes. So these are intelligent people. They know exactly what they're doing. Yes. Yes. On November 18 and 19, 100 Ugandans killed. Yes. Why? They protested the arrest of their candidate. Yes. What do you want? Yes. The election stolen yes. in January. And then what happened after that? They, I mean, their money. Money. they started kidnapping yes. and killing and torturing young people. Yes. Until now. And what did the IMF do? Yes. They rewarded him with one billion dollars yes. on June 28. Let's clap for After IMF. All these yes. yes, let's clap. Congratulations. Congratulations. Yes. IMF. And now look at the latest case we are dealing with in Uganda. Yes. Kakwenza. Rukino yes. Right. Kakwenza wrote a book, The Greedy Barbarian. Yes, Museveni. Museveni read the book and looked at the mirror and he said, wait, that's me he's talking about. Yes, guilty. Arrested and tortured. Yes. He wrote another book, Banana, Banana, Banana Republic, Republic. Yes. where writing is treasonous. Yes. Arrested again and tortured. Yes. Released after international outcry. Yes. Arrested again December 28th yes. after he posted a tweet. And the tweet said, General Muhosi Kairugaba is obese. Yes, he is. Yeah, and he is. He is. He is. That's a factual statement. So Kakwenza is giving him advice. Maybe you should go to the gym. Yes, right. Instead of going to the gym yeah, and yeah. eating properly yes. and maybe abandoning booze, what does he do? Arrest, 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 arrest and torture Kakwenza. Yes. Sisters and brothers. And IMF, do you know why I'm holding this in my hand? No. Do you know what they did with this thing? Oh my God. Wow. You I like interviewed Kakwenza's lawyer yesterday on my radio show, WBI, Aaron Kiza. They used a plier oh to take off the meat from his thighs. Oh Both of his thighs. Oh they plucked the flesh and took the meat off. Is a murderer. This is Mohosi. And then you know what? This is David Dunn. And this I is need to go see IMF the bastard in there. So I have money. This is for you. You can you keep this. You can keep this and give this to Georgina Katumina. The using their is to chop up the people's This is what face. they use to take the meat from Kakwenza and put it on his thighs. That is why the regime does not want to release Kakwenza. Yes, yes, because yes. they yes. want to yes. the yes. and Mohosi yes. 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 don't want Kakwenza to show his legs to the world. That's what they did to his leg and his back, the same thing. So I am, thank you for the good job. Thank you for the good job and thank you again. And this is for you. Keep that. Thank you, Sister.